Hi there, everyone. I'm meteorologist Ashley Baylor with a check of your latest forecast. Well, because of that northeast breeze today, it was rather cool. Temperatures only warming into the upper 40s near 50 degrees, although at times I'm sure it felt even cooler than that. The good news is a warming trend starts this week. We just have to get through Monday and Tuesday. Our average high for this time of year is 61 degrees, but we'll be back in the upper 40s near 50 degrees tomorrow. So pretty much a rinse and repeat forecast of what we saw today. We'll be in the low 50s Tuesday, and then you can see temperatures start to surge into the mid and upper. 60s on Wednesday, then we're talking 70s on Thursday, but as always, it comes with a little bit of a trade off. Now, as we go through the overnight hours, we'll still see a few scattered clouds out there. Overall, a decent amount of sunshine expected on Monday. We'll call for a mix of sun and clouds. And once again, it is going to be on the breezy side with winds back out of the northeast at 10 to 15 miles per hour. As we go from Monday night on into Tuesday, we'll have mainly clear skies. But then on Tuesday, a deck of high clouds are going to start to move into the region. So on Tuesday, we're going to see more of that filtered sunshine look, almost as though somebody pulled a thin sheet of clouds over the sun. So it'll appear bright, but there are still going to be high clouds out there. So for tomorrow, look for high about 48 degrees in Elizabeth City, 52 in Edenton, 49 degrees in Hatteras. Across the south side, 48 in Norfolk, 50 in Chesapeake, 49 degrees in Franklin. Across the peninsula, we'll still have that cool breeze, so that'll keep temperatures near 47 degrees in Pocosin, 49 in Smithfield, 52 in Williamsburg, points north of that and along the eastern shore, 45 in Melfa, and 48 degrees in Gloucester. Here's a look at our seven day forecast. So we're in the mid to upper 60s on Wednesday. That'll feel much better than it has been recently. 72 degrees on Thursday with a chance for a couple of showers out there, but we do have a better chance for widespread showers as we go into Friday. Temperatures in the mid 60s there. That'll be courtesy of a cold front that comes through. But luckily, behind that cold front, it doesn't really cool down very much. You can look forward to 60s for next weekend.